Hey y'all, welcome back. Oh my goodness, it is always something and I am so sorry it has been forever. Let me wipe this off really quick. Sorry, okay. Maybe that's a little better, but anyway. You know what? I'm not even going to refilm that. I'm just going to keep going because, you know, it's just, it's not my video if there's not something going wrong. So, this is today's look. You like? And then this is what we're working with. So, okay. So, today I am going to be doing the Cool Pinks palette from Mary Kay. It's the brand new palette. We have Warm Pinks and Cool Pinks. I have already done, I want to show you the warm pinks. Um, I have already done a video on the warm pinks, so now I'm doing the cool pinks. So, these are both awesome palettes to have. Um, if you want, you know, a little pop of color on the eyes. If you just, even if you just want, like, you know, mix it with other colors. You don't have to use the whole palette, you know, itself. You can, you know, mix it with other colors. So, I'm just going to do a quick little tutorial on this. I'm also going to be using the brand new um, blending eye blending brush from Mary Kay. I've already used it in this, so that's why it's kind of looking powdery. So what I do is I take biscotti. I'm trying to use up part of an old one, so that's why I've got it out. But anyway, this is biscotti. It's like a very matte white kind of color, and I'm just going to take it and brush that all over the lid. In a certain way, just brush it all over the lid, all the way up to the brows, all the way down to the lash line. So, all over the lid. And, yeah, so that's what we're doing. So, now that we've got that ready to go, and I've got all my other makeup on. So, I'm going to take an all-over color brush. And this is one from a set that we had a long time back, but I'm still using it. So, And I'm going to put it in this color right here. So, I just load up my brush. And it is so pretty and so sparkly. And I just kind of pat it on there like this to kind of place the color where I want it. And then, and before I did the biscotti, I did put on eye primer earlier. So, went ahead and did this eye, and I went ahead and just let that eye dry. So, now I'm going on here again with the same color in the same spot. And I'm going to pat it on there just a little bit. And then I'm just going to kind of do a little sweeping motions all around just to kind of blend it up. And just to kind of blend it around. So just kind of sweep in motions back and forth like that. So, and now you see where it's starting to look like that over there. All right, and now I'm going to come in with my crease brush. And we're going to do this color right here. This like darker sparkly color. And I just kind of do like that. Load up my brush. And I start with patting it on there. And just kind of making a line where I want it to go. And then once I get my line, I just kind of start swiping it back and forth like that. And then I blend it up as high as I want it. And then we get it like that. So, and now I just, I put my brush back in that color a little bit. And then I just kind of pat it on again and make that line. And I usually bring it all the way over here, too, just so that, you know, there's no lines or anything when I take the next color and blend it. So, okay. So, that's that color. Now, I'm going to come in with this very end color with an all-over eyeshadow brush. And I only go in with it one time because it's very, very pig All of these colors are very pigmented, but this one's really dark. So, I just kind of come in here and do like that. And then... I just kind of make a like an upside down L shape. And I know that y'all say there's fallout right there, but that's why I always put powder up under my eyes before I start makeup so it does just wipe right off. So now I'm just going to kind of take little swiping motions and just kind of blend that out to where I want it and get it all blended to where I need it. Okay, now. I'm going to take my, um, well, what is this one called? I can't even think of the name of it. Eye Smudger. Eye Smudger Brush. I can never remember the names of these brushes. <laughs> anyway, okay, so I Smudger Brush. I'm going to take this light color down here and just kind of load it up on my brush and just kind of go on the perimeter of the eyeshadow. Get 
give it a little shine and then blend it out okay so now i know that i haven't blended that light color out yet so i'm going to take this biscotti color again and come up here and blend this lighter color out little small strokes and i even blend up there a little bit too okay so now i'm not adding any more color i'm just going to take what's left on this eye crease brush and just kind of swipe back and forth a little bit to bring that color out a little bit so it's not so like faded and then i'm going to take the last all over color eye brush with the darker one and just kind of smudge it right here just a little bit just to bring that dark color back out now and now i'm going to do some eyeliner and then i actually i'm going to go ahead and dust that off i do put a tiny little bit of powder on there and just dust it off like that and then i'm gonna do my eyeliner It's like super hard to talk while doing eyeliner. You would think I would have mastered talking while doing literally anything, but not this. All right, then I'm gonna smudge it really quick. And then I will be right back. I'm gonna go put on my mascara and I'll be right back. Okay, and that's the finished look. I've got mascara, I've got my eyeliner done, everything is done. So that is the finished look and I hope everyone likes it. And so comment below on what you'd like to see next. Follow me on social media at Living Victoriously on Facebook. Hair Makeup by Victoria on Facebook and Instagram. Victoria Miss Fabulous on Instagram. Victoria Tauber on Facebook. And yeah, so y'all have a great day. And tell your friends, share this video, and subscribe. Bye, have a great day.